Hi friends, welcome to Brilliant Frames, a special story time where we learn together about the brilliant brains who changed our world. Created for you with love by me, Miss Julie Mack, so that our hearts and our brains can grow together. I am so excited about this week's Brilliant Brain, and I can't wait to share with you about this amazing person who changed our world. Let's learn together. Are you ready to learn? Let's put on our thinking caps and get ready to brainstorm. Bye. This week's Brilliant Brain is George Washington Carver a prominent black scientist in the 20th century who helped us learn a lot about plants. Do you have a garden at your house? I love plants. I love to grow plants. I love to study plants. And so did George Washington Carver. Let's learn about this incredible man together. George loved the earth. He loved plants flowers, and trees. Why do they grow? George asked. Have you ever asked a question like that? You must be a brilliant brain, just like George. Raise your hand if you love to play outside. I love being outside in the warm air and sunshine. It is my favorite thing. And George loved to be outside too. He liked to play in the fields close to where he lived. And while he was playing, he noticed that plants have different parts. Plants have stems, plants have leaves, and plants have roots. George wanted to learn more. So he did something that you do too. George went to school to learn more about plants and how they grow. George became a scientist. He created peanut butter, peanut oil, and even peanut soap. Would you want to take a bath in peanut soap? I love peanut butter, but I'm not sure if I want to take a bath with peanut soap. Do you think it smells like peanuts? George helped farmers. He taught them to grow other crops. He helped them grow sweet potatoes, peanuts, and other crops to help make the soil healthy. People loved George's ideas. They called him the plant doctor because he helped them heal their crops. How cool is that? Do you think anyone brought George a peanut butter cake to celebrate all of his accomplishments? I know I wish I could. George helped people plants and the earth and he showed us how we can help care for our world. I just am so grateful for George Washington Carver and his studies in botany. Don't you wish you could give George Washington Carver a big hug for all of the things that he helped us learn today? Thank you for tuning in to our very first episode of Brilliant Brains. I hope that your brain and your heart grew a little bit today. We'll see you next time.